engine cycles. And this is our UI2 or DI2 Altegra disc brake crossbar. Tell me about it. So it has the new TRP hydraulic cable actuated brakes. It has the electronic shifting with all hidden wires. So there's no wires up there. Disc brakes, I'm sorry, new, new disc brake dropouts that I designed and had done this past like six months been working on. As the tapered steer tube, oversized head tube. Those dropouts are pretty sweet. What was the uh, inspiration? Uh, I wanted to utilize the, the chainstay as the mounting point just because I, I like to incorporate the rear triangle as your bracing structure as opposed to when the brake lives on the outside. And when you do that, you have to deal with a lot of clearance issues because the seat stays get in the way of a lot of brakes. It is a very large brake, but yet it has a lot of clearance for the, the seat stays, and a lot of it is because of the way the dropout drops down and then moves forward. And the other thing that we did was the, the derailleur hanger is completely removed of any mounting point of the wheel, and that allows us to do two things. This is the traditional hanger, and then we also have a Shimano direct mount hanger, so it does both the direct mount and the traditional. material that was unnecessary, that didn't affect its stiffness, and the kind of a truss bridge structure. And frame material? It's titanium. 